Good morning, Spirit of God Christian Church. And here we are on Wednesday morning, hump day once again, day 17 of the churchwide corporate fast. I'm so proud of you. We are getting it done and we're walking through this journey together. I thank each and every one of you for standing firm and standing true in this fast before the Lord. This is a fast that the Lord has ordained. And so he's certainly gonna bless it. As we continue to focus in on trusting him in the midst of it all, we have to make sure that we continue to put our trust in the true and living God. I wanna thank all of you who were a part of our services over the weekend on Sunday, uh, as well as I know in here in Georgia, we had some of the snow and some of the things like that coming in. Some is forecasted to come in maybe later this week, but we know we trust God. And as some of the old saints would say, it's the Lord's weather. So we, put, we know we certainly trust the one whose weather it is. I just pray that you're in a place where you're safe. I pray that you are just walking in what the Lord has for you each and every day. And I, today, I want you to be energized. And I really do want you to just have great faith in the Lord today on this hump day. So our scripture today, which again, can be found on Church's app and website, comes from Psalm chapter 40, verse four. And it says, blessed is the one who trusts in the Lord. Right there in just the A clause, I could really stop right there. But it says, who does not look to the proud, to, the, to those who turn aside to false gods. What it's saying is, my heroes, my role models aren't those who are proud, who are prideful, who boast about what they have and what they do. My idols aren't those who worship anyone other than the true and living God. I don't look to others as role models for me who don't worship the true and living God. As a matter of fact, Psalm 1 even reminds us to not walk in the counsel of the ungodly. So what it says is, but blessed is the one who trusts in the Lord. I don't put my trust in man. I don't make man my role models, especially if they are prideful or they're following other gods. What I do, though, is I settle in a place where I put my trust in the true and living God. So today, let's be deliberate. Let's be intentional. Let's be purposeful to say, God, I'm going to put my eyes and keep my eyes on you. I'm going to put my trust in you. Jesus Christ is my role model for he lived life and did it perfectly. And as a result of that, I'm going to continue to put my trust in you for I know that's where my blessings lie. I know I won't be disappointed. I know your love for me is unfailing. All right, Spirit of God Christian Church, on this hump day to get you over, make sure that you keep your trust, put your trust, keep your trust in the true and living God and nowhere else. God bless you. God keep you is our prayer. Go out, get day 17 done.